this is Taylor Thomas with Politics 963. She is a phenomenal woman. She's a singer, songwriter, a mother, producer, an actress. Sold over 40 million albums worldwide, <laughs> making her one of the best selling female artists of all times. Um, yes, of course, I'm talking about Grammy Award winning actress, artist, Brandy. She is in town here in D.C. starring in the production Chicago at the Kennedy Center. We are so excited to have you. Thank you for joining us today. Oh, thank you. What a nice introduction. I appreciate and welcome that. back to D.C. Thank you very much. <laughs> well, this is not the first time that you starred as Roxy. If I'm correct, your debut on Broadway is 2015? Yes, I, I did on Broadway for four months. I, it, it completely changed my life. And then I did it in uh, L.A. for a week at the Pantages. And now I'm here to do it for, for you guys at the Kennedy Center. So Brandy, for people that are not familiar with Chicago or Roxy, who you star, mm -hmm. tell us a little bit about her and what our DC theater goers can expect. Uh, it's, it's just, it's, it's women that, um, uh, crime of passion, you know, they had crimes of passion and they're all, you know, behind bars, but they're still all dreaming and trying to get out and become, you know, who they're meant to be. And for Roxy, she wants to be a dancer, she's a singer, she's a, you know, she just dreams all the time. She wants to be on top and she does whatever it takes to, to get out of to get out of her circumstance so she can get back out there in the world and 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 be herself, be Roxy Hart. Now you are so well rounded. You're an actress. I mentioned you're a singer, you're a producer. I mean, how do you find time to put it all together to make it work like it does for you? Compartmentalize. Okay. I okay. compartmentalize and um, there's a there's a true balance to my life now that I didn't have before. I started very young, so yes. you know, I learned a lot of things the hard way. But now that I'm in this space, I'm I'm thirty eight and I I just know how to um, you know, put in the right discipline for the right projects and and balance my life, and and I love the mental space that I'm in, so I can continue to set an example for my daughter and and for other artists out there that, that need um, that need guidance in any kind of way. So, as you know, this segment is politics nine six three, mm -hmm. and as a black woman, I want to talk to you. How are your thoughts? What are your thoughts about what's going on politically in the world that we live in today? Well, I don't I don't normally talk about the the politics of the of the world. I I. I, I I've always uh, stayed away from that. Um, I can definitely say for me, my focus is the higher laws mm -hmm. of the universe. There is a higher being, and we need to learn those laws, and we need to get in touch with our own mind, and learn how to control the instrument, mm -hmm. and because you know, the mind is all over the place. And what people don't know, you know, belief is the law of your mind, and if you put anything in your mind, you hear so many things, and you start to dwell on the negative parts of your mind, then that's what you will manifest. Mm -hmm. And I think that if people really knew that that was where their power um, resides, then they wouldn't put a lot of different things in their mind. So for me, I, 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 I look away. Okay. And I and I go within, and I try to be of service in my own way to be the change that I wish to see in the world. Okay. Well, earlier this week, trending was black women working. Yes. So, and that is definitely you with all the titles that you have on a daily basis. Uh, what are your thoughts about black women in today's workforce? Well, I think as 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 women. Mm -hmm. We should pay attention to what we want to pay attention to. And what we should pay attention to is that we are bleeping brilliant, <laughs> and we are bleeping strong, and we are bleeping um, powerful, mm -hmm. and you are the only thinker in your mind, and God only listens to your thoughts about you, so that's what you say to yourself. And that's what I say to myself. And that's why I'm sitting right here talking to you. And that must be what you're saying to yourself, because you're sitting here talking to me. You're exactly and she's right. She's saying that, and she's saying because we are all here, mm -hmm. and we need to know that you know we are a force to be reckoned with. Mm. And 
nobody can touch us if we don't allow them to. And that's something that you, I'm sure, instill in your daughter. Absolutely. How is she now? My daughter's 14. Wow. And she is very confident. I'm sure. In herself. And she has her own voice. And you have a strong mother, so I know she has a strong voice. <laughs> So, um, you know, again, I want to thank you so very much for coming here. we got to make sure that we mention to you that this phenomenal actress mother is, is in town starring as Roxy in the production Chicago, which starts April 4th through the 16th. Yes, please. You have to come out. Please it's come. sold out everywhere else, and we know it's going to sell out here, too. Thank so you. get your tickets. I will be there along with our WHUR family. Yeah. We'll be there and support. And again, we thank you so much for thank coming. You. And I thank you. We appreciate your time thank and your talent, and thanks for choosing to come to D.C. Thank you. God bless you. Well, thank you so much. I appreciate that. Thank you. Well, that'll do it for Politics 963. I am Taylor Thomas. Yeah. Remember, stay connected. All things social media, Twitter, Instagram, at Politics 963. And remember, use the hashtag, stay woke. Yes, stay woke! <laughs> yes! I love it.